rares from 10 packs. That's not terrible. I've had much worse pulls before. Nice. Alright, so we still can get the Vampire Lord. That's okay. That's fine. If you're gonna play Yu-Gi-Oh, you should just do it on YGO Pro 2. All cards free. Well, yeah, see, there is that. But there's also dealing with the fact that there's like Synchro, there's those white fucking cards, there's all that other crazy bullshit I don't care a fuck about. I like this because it still has mostly all the shit that I still fucking understand. I hate new Yu-Gi-Oh! Because I don't get it. It's confusing as hell to me. This... The most complicated shit it just does is like, you know, fusion or like, ritual shit. You know? This is just... More accessible to me. Modern Yu-Gi-Oh! is confusing as fuck. Just saying. Pendulum Summon is confusing? Yeah! Fuck that shit, no thanks. Alright, let me read this Mizuki card. 1700 4 drop. You can banish this card from your graveyard, then target one zombie monster in your graveyard and special summon that target. Holy fuck. That's broken. And it's still a solid fucking 4 drop, too. What the hell? <laughs> Whatever. Fuck it. Oh! Oh, so I finally got to the second, like, part of this game. Check this out. I was really surprised. So watch this shit. So now I'm in GX land. And now watch. Now we're in this fucking area. It's just like the GX place that like the dual cat, remember the fuck they called it? This fucking Chaz. Or the fuck his name is. It's really neat. I like it. And when it first happened, it like loaded it all in. Like it all went like wireframe and shit. And it all like brought it in. It was really cool looking. I was surprised. But apparently right now, uh, elemental hero decks are not the best. There's not a full good roster of elemental heroes out. Which kind of sucks, because I was kind of down to fuck around with those. But, oh uh, well. Oh well. Anyway, let's go back to the other one. I think most people generally were the OG Yu-Gi-Oh! people fans. Synchros are adding... Are adding and XYZ are matching? That's just confusing. <sighs> Ojama deck is better anyway. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. For those who don't know of the bullshit Ojama's about. So here's the thing. For, okay, actually, I, I fucked that. I don't want to go there. Here's the thing about Ojama Ojama's broken. Okay? Look at this shit. Check this out. So, we have three spell slots, and three monster slots, right? Look what this fucking card does. Select up to three of your opponent's monster card zones, the selected zones cannot be used. So pretty much, they can't even summon anything with this fucker out. That's some broken ass shit. <laughs> like, what the hell? <laughs> That's some broken, jank ass shit, dude. <laughs> Oh, man. Ugh. So, like... Fuck. I guess that's a thing. Oh! And you know what fucking also really sucks? So... They have this kind of crazy shit, right? And they have Esperoba in the game right now as, like, an event. And his main fucking card is Jinzo. But you can't fucking get Jinzo! You can't get him! They don't let you get Jinzo! That's bullshit! Like, he can even summon Jinzo! But we can't get Jinzo. I'm tilted, man. I'm fucking tilted. I want a Jinzo. So bad. Because, like, I- I remember... When I- when I was young... I think it was 8th grade. I used to go every Sunday. There was a tournament for Yu-Gi-Oh! at my uh, local, like, card shop. It wasn't really local. I had to drive, like, you know, 20 minutes out as an 8th grader. But, uh, so I went there, and I was, you know, I was really, you know, I was nice because, you know, I was a young kid and was there alone and shit. And the shop owner... Was like, hey, can you help me, uh, you know, clean up? Because I, I had to stay a little bit after the tournament was over for my mom to come pick me up. 
So she was like, you know, come help me. Like, can you help me pick up? And I'm like, yeah, lady, I'll help you. And so I helped her and she gave me a free pack. I was like, oh, that's so cool. Thank you. And I opened the pack and it was fucking Jinzo in that bitch. It was dope as hell. Ugh. I was happy. And Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro 2, you can set a password and matches to stool viewers and tell them nothing newer than Ritual Infusion. Well, see, that's that's great and all, but there's no sense of, like, earning anything. If you have access to everything, there's no sense of, like, pride or anything. There's just that sense of, like, you know, I have access to everything. I want to do this deck now. And this one, you have to, like, you know, you earn your shit and you climb the ladder and shit. I like that sense of things, you know? I like the casualness of it. It feels nice. I feel like the other one's a little too, like, serious and tryhardy sounding. Progression. I need progression. You're not gonna sit there and play your Call of Duty if you don't level up every other match. Right? Right. I'm gonna fuck up Esperova real quick. Level 30? I'll fucking just, just do it. Let's crush him. Uh, earn your shit. Proceeds to buy packs. Well, of course you're gonna buy packs still. It's a card game, goddammit. But you still earn a bunch of shit, too, in this game. Like, you can earn packs for days in this shit if you just play it. Okay. I'm gonna fuck him up. Yeah, it sends a pride accomplishment. Exactly. You understand. Alright, hold on. We got this. Go Izuki. We gotta throw Ill Bud in there. Or Ill Blood or the fuck. Better. Lady Miss for 10 months, thanks. Alright. So, uh, I guess we'll just put it down for now. Whatever. It's fine. Well, this is really fast. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a lot slower on when you're actually versing people. This is just the, the AI right now. He understands your desire for a sense of pride and accomplishment. It does. It absolutely does. <sighs> Shit! Uh-oh! Gozuki, no! Oh no, Gozuki! Oh shit, another one? Are you fucking kidding me, dog? That bitch is dual wielding right now. Swords of Dark Destruction. Uh-oh. But I'm gonna activate Gozuki's effects when he goes to the graveyard. I'm gonna banish Illblood, cause fuck that nerd. And we're gonna summon Red Eye Zombie Dragon in attack mode. Let's fuck that guy. Thank you, Jordan Dubiel. Bam! Wall of Disruption. Alright, we're gonna put down Bacon Boy here. Actually, you know what? We're gonna put in attack mode. I ain't afraid. Put that down. And we're gonna activate the beatdown skill. Everything will get 300 more. Gonna battle. Now, see, beatdown skill, that's a thing that's not in the actual game. That's purely Duel Links related shit. This is like... This is like a spin-off of Yu-Gi-Oh. I like it, though. It's a lot more... I don't know. Accessible. Thank you, Dona Is Fuentes. Oh, what you got, Esperoba? Are you gonna beat up my Bacon Boy? Oh, no, not my Bacon Boy. <gasps> Oh no, Bacon Boy. Well, I could, mm, yeah. Bacon Boy, he's gonna kick your butt. Good boy, Bacon Boy. Nice, solid. Vampire Lord. Bye, Bacon Boy. Look at this. Look at this shit. Oh. oh, he's so cool. Vampire Lord for Marvel vs. Capcom, please. <laughs> Fuck him up. Never gonna be as good of a dueler as Joey. <laughs> yeah, you're right. What a hottie, I know, right? That's why I need another one of them in my deck. 
I need the animation more in my life. Darkstalkers? Yeah, it's pretty much Darkstalkers. Alright, we fucked him up. We got an armed ninja. One of the OG fucking cards in the game. <gasps> Speaking of OG, yo, check it. Hold on a second. Yo, in my original deck, when I was a kid, I always had three of these fuckers in it. Check it out. Actually, wait, why do I go there? I gotta go to my card catalog. Look at this motherfucking OG bitch that I got. I was so happy. Check it out. Motherfucking man-eater bug. Apparently there's like a crazy version of him. That's nuts. But there's man-eater bug. Dude. Man-eater bug was this shit. I always just piss people off because I had so many. I rocked three of these and three Hain Hains. Is Hain Hain in the game? I think it was like this, right? Oh, he is. Hell yeah, dog. Three of these and three Hain Hains. Or, I'm sorry. Three Hain Hains and three Man Eater Bugs. That's how I should say it because I'm showing Hain Hain. But I was just a fucking asshole. And then my my beat down card over the fuck, my power card was summon skull. Because it's like all these nerds are running like, oh look at me, I got dark magician and shit. Wow. Well bitch, you gotta sacrifice two fucking things for yours. I just gotta tribute one monster for 2500 attack. You're fucking done, son. So me and my dark fucking magician killers summon skull over here. We crushed that shit. Wait, that's is an ultra rare? Yeah, they changed the rarities for this game. So some cards are ultra rare, some cards are not, you know, it's, it's, it's something. What is it? What's this in? It's an ultimate rising. Okay. It's pretty neat. Some skull was legit the very first meta of the game when it came out. You ran meta? Did I? That was before I even would have known to how to look up a meta in the first place. I was just some fucking eighth grader just playing his game. I don't know, man. Playing a Konami game, so I expect better from you. Motherfucker, it's goddamn Yu-Gi-Oh. I... This is my childhood, son. Let me embrace myself. Fuck. This game have tune cards? Yes. Actually, that is one of the metas. Is, uh, Toon Barrel Dragon. Because it is disgusting. And horrifying. Yeah, dude, Summon Skull was the best monster in the game because it had the attack of a two tribute monster for one tribute. I know, right? It's fucking lit. Fuck, fuck Meg. Auto duel this bitch. Let's go. Fuck Meg. Is that Dijins? The green genie with the 1800 attack? Not sure. It has War Raiders though. Oh god. Oh god. Here we go. Here we go. Check this out. Put the bacon in there. Auto duel going in hard. Shit. Fuck Parasite. Parasite. You kidding me with that shit? Get the fuck out of here. Tribute that shit. Go big boy. Oh, bam! Two, two of them. Going in hard. Going in hard. Snarky Tart. Thank you for two months. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Slamming it. Oh. Sorry, Meg. You just weren't good enough. I like how like she was shrieking. I'm like posing. Yeah! I'm Sido Kaiba. It's like, man, you're a fucking cool guy. Beating on a fucking girl. She's just trying to have a good time. Like, look at look at her, like, this poor woman. Look at this shit. Hang on. Oh, oh, oh. Get, get, get out of here with this shit. Look, look at this poor woman. Aw, I didn't win. I should do the Vagabond more often to gain more experience. Yeah, whatever. I'm posing over here like a badass. Fuck it. Alright. Let's do PvP. Let's do some PvP. We gotta climb the ranks. We're only gold rank 3. We're not good enough yet. We're gonna fight real people. Kaiba never had any chill. He really didn't. I also like how the the scene where Kaiba versus Yugi, like the first time he pulls Exodian shit, Kaiba has like, you know, shallow cheeks and he looks like an old fucking man and shit. It's fucking nuts. <gasps> Going second. Oh shit. What am I playing this on? This is on Steam right here. <gasps> this motherfucker was during the Bones thing. I wish I could have been there during the Bones thing. F 
fuck. Alright, this guy's been around for at least longer than I have. <gasps> a Naturia deck. Fuck. Uh-oh. Okay. Alright. Let's see if we can handle this shit. Set that. Do I attack? Probably shouldn't. I will, though. What does he got? Draining shield. Okay. I've been running into people with this sh a lot, actually. Seems to be pretty popular. Are your cool mats and sleeves? I think mats look really dumb in this game. So I don't have any. Alright, what you got? Another one? Okay. Okay. I got this to save my dick. Put a pumpkin in the graveyard? Okay. Well, he's gonna put them both back in the deck anyway. Alright. So, he's gonna draw one more card. He might draw a, draw a hyd Hydrangea, maybe. Yeah? Did he? He did. Okay. <gasps> Not beat down! Oh no! Battle! Oh no! What could I possibly do? Windstorm of Etequa. I grinded on fucking my Valentine for this fucking card. So all of his guys go... <gasps> you bitch! Son of a bitch! Alright. Wait, how much? No! Wait! Ah, oh, I was gonna... Fuck. I was about to... I just wanted to see what the board was. Shit! Ah, oh, I could have saved it. I could have absolutely saved it and we would have been fine. Damn it. Well, that's what I get for pressing a button and forgetting what it actually meant. I wanted to look at their attack and see what they were at. <laughs> Fuck. Well, it's okay. We might still be okay. This is why Duel Links isn't nice. That's already GG. Yeah, that's okay. It happens. Oh. This, it is GG. It's fucking, oh god. If we did, if we didn't fuck up, we would still be in this game, but we're not. Damn it! <sighs> oh well, that's okay. Bad luck. Bad luck. I'll just let him kill me because if I surrender, I don't think I get anything for it. Someone's believing in the heart of the cards much? Well, I'm Kaiba. Kaiba doesn't believe in the heart of the cards. We would have been fine, though. 4k life points in 2017. Yeah, dude. They go quick games in this ship. So I can check out the Jin cards. It sadly has... Only has two of them I checked and not the best, but they're fun to use still. The Jin cards, huh? Hmm. Alright. Let me check that out real quick. Fucked up. Believe in the heart of the money, Jesus. Alright, let me let me check these cards real quick. Too much Kaiba vocals? Oh yeah. Fucking Kaiba vs Kaiba. That's how it fucking goes, dude. Alright, let me see here. Oh. Well, I got one of them. When you ritual summon a monster, you can banish this card from your graveyard as one of the monster required for the ritual summon. If a player ritual summons using this card, if wait wait, if a player if that ritual summon monster inflicts battle damage to the other player, they discard one card. Oh wow. Uh, when you ritual summon a monster, you can banish this card from your graveyard as one of the ritual. The monster ritual summon using this card is unaffected by trap effects. Oh wow. Well, it's all about like 
Oh god, this is the one I want. This creature generates gale force winds and tornadoes that blow its enemies away. If I use this card, then natural, uh, like, freaking disasters will be generated at my opponent's house, and I will not die. It's perfect. Wow. I'll try that. Yeah, I don't. I don't run. I don't run ritual though. Shit. All right. Let's try this again. We won't fuck up this time. I'm gonna count that loss as a uh, me just fucking up my buttons. That's pretty much it. I fucked up the buttons. You saw me. Okay, we're playing a guy against Hong Kong. He's in Hong Kong, I mean. It's gonna go great. Bandit Keith, he's gonna cheat. Oh, man. Also, CR Mars. Hey, Cry. Lily's on Mars here. Finally got that name changed. Hey! I got an interview for a manager job Monday. So take my bits for luck. Love you, man. Nice, dog. I hope it works out. All right, let's go, Keith. Setting floodgate and enemy controller down. Gazuki, my dude, get out there. Activate effect. All right, so we'll go ahead and uh, do bacon. Okay, you do you. I have no cr idea what you're saying, but it cry, but it sounds great. Thanks, man. Yu-Gi-Oh is great. If you have any questions about the fuck's going on, please let me know. I'll try to guide you. I'm not a professional by any means. Pot of Greed is not in this game also. I'm sorry if that offends you. Vampire Koala, huh? I don't know if that's going to be worth the floodgate. I might just enemy controller him. We'll see what he does. What does Pottergree do? I don't know, dude. Do you know? Alright, is he gonna attack? He's ending his turn? He didn't even attack. I got my other Kazuki. Alright. Activate this effect. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do some crazy shit. Are you ready? Okay, check this fucking play out. Alright, here we go. You fucking ready for this shit? I'm fucking ready for this shit. So get ready for this shit. We're going to go ahead and do enemy controller. We're gonna tribute my Gazuki. I'm going to take his Vampire Koala. See what he does. Activate Kazuki's effect. We're going to get rid of my Bacon Boy. I'm going to special summon a Kazuki. And we're going to summon another Kazuki. And now we're just going to go fucking in. Hit him immediately with this guy. We'll get 1800 health from doing this. We're going to hit him with that. That, might, that. that right there is the only thing that could potentially stop us. I don't know what it is. I don't think he's got anything though. Because he would have probably used it by now. I think we just won. <gasps> Nitwit Outwit. Discard one monster and the target monster loses attack equal to the original attack. He discarded. What did he discard? Holy shit! That thing is insane! Alright, well, we got 4,000. Wait, am I drunk? Dumb? Just kind of fix battle damage to your opponent. Oh, by battle with a monster. Never mind. I thought it was straight up lifesteal. I'm stupid. Don't mind me. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Fuck. All right, well that sucks. He's gonna get 1800 now. Ah, oh, that, oof. All right, that sucks. This is our life now. We're actually in a shitty situation here. I hope he tributes 
Okay, he put that out. I'm gonna floodgate that one though. There we go. Okay. So he's gonna attack that. He's gonna get 1800 health back because that's a zero. Fuck. If you could explain the game the best you can to my little bro, what do you say? Um. Trap card! Backface, thanks for three months, man. Could have used B-Town last turn? <gasps> no, actually, no, I couldn't. B-Town is only if you have a level five or more monsters. No B-Town. Another enemy controller. Okay. This is an awkward situation. Set this first. I I forgot to actually activate his ability. That's okay. That's fine. I forgot to activate Kazuki's ability. <laughs> what is this? If this card is removed, oh. This is some crazy shit for Sphinxes or some crap. Do they have any Harpy decks yet? I think so. Switcheroo. What does this do? What What did he just do? What does that even mean? Did he just put a card back in Shuffle? He just lost 500 points? What just happened? He special summoned a monster? Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Fuck. Wait, this card cannot be special summoned by the graveyard. This card destroys the defense as a result of battle inflict damage to your opponent's life points to the half of the destroyed monster. He's doing another one? What the fuck? Another one? Okay. Okay. Do I have any any wins here? Any chance? <sighs> Enemy controller. Would that? No. I think the only thing I do is just. I think I'm fucked. I'm just gonna, hang on, I'm just gonna activate this real quick. I'm just gonna stop him from attacking, just so I can keep him out. I might, might pull through and do some crazy shit. Vampire Lord. Ah, uh, that ain't gonna do shit. I was hoping. I was hoping I'd get something else. I, I don't think I have any outs now. We're done. We're done. Fuck. Well, we tried. I'll summon it just for the effect, because it looks cool. Why not? I mean, look at this thing. It's pretty cool, right? It's pretty good. Look at that. It's pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, I can activate the skill, but it ain't gonna do shit. If he was in attack mode, even then he wouldn't die. Or he wouldn't... Yeah, like once. That's that's best I got. <laughs> We're done. Shit. Cool and useless. Yeah, exactly. Like my fucking career. Ah. Yeah, those things suck. Yeah? What, do another switcheroo thing? Attack during the turn that is normal summon or special summon. So it's just a crazy fucking wall of defense, huh? We're done. We're fucking done. Damn, that's two for two so far that we've lost. Got milled? I didn't get milled. 
We just got fucked up, if anything. 